Hello, this is Hasku of Hasku Gaming Inc., and I'm going to be bringing you more of my StarCraft II Heart of the S or, uh, I'm sorry, Wings of Liberty campaign playthrough. It's been a little while since I've actually recorded any of this, so I'm not quite sure where I was. Some of my favorite missions in the entire campaign right there. Let's go right out of the armory. little bit of an in-game tip there, use siege tanks and bunkers. So, what upgrades do we have for the siege tank? We've got shaped blast and maelstrom rounds. We also, oh, these are some good things. Uh, I'm going to grab that real quick. That lets me use multiple SCVs to get uh, construction on things done faster. That's decent, but it's not really something that I need. Uh, as for the rest of this, I think I'll pass for now. Save up a little bit. Let's go to the cantina. This is Donnie Vermillion, live from UNN. Tonight, the Zerg invasion. The battle so far. The Terran Dominion is holding firm under Zerg aggression. Our industrial complex has stepped up production on all fronts. Enlistment rates have risen within the penal system, and the Marine Corps is ready to get in the fight. The Zerg won't know what hit them. Donnie, has there been any word on when we start pushing the aliens back? Kate, if I revealed that, I'd be giving away vital Dominion secrets. You think the Zerg watch our broadcast? I know they do, Kate. I know they do. Well, you heard it here first, folks. This is Kate Mockwell for UNN. Well then, that's interesting. Tosh, you were one strange individual. Tychus? Finally, to the lab before I head over. I could get uh, some new mercenaries, but I'm not really that interested in that. So now I have this Ehan crystal here. Got the artifact. Okay, now I've got a uh, new bit of text in the Protoss tank. If you feel like it, feel free to pause here and read that. So, if you're trying to pause now, too late. Hanson?
That may be because he's actually fought them. Just a theory. So now I have my first little bit of research here. I tend to go for... That. So basically... Uh, that's a little loud, actually. What this does is... This one... Will, uh... Make your HP greater every time that you get an armor uh, upgrade on, in the engineering bay. And this one will make your units attack faster. So they're tiny upgrades, but I prefer that one. So I'm going to go for that. Okay, and then I'm actually going to go for the crystal here. Okay, so this is mission objective: investigate Zelnaga shrines on Ulan. Research research opportunities: three Protoss, three Zerg. So let's go right on in here. Okay, looks pretty good. So I'm not sure if I've explained this, but, um, oh, never mind. Do you hear them, Zeratu? Whispering from 
from the stars. The galaxy will burn. They're coming. Okay. Is is that the end? Okay, I have a cursor, that means yep, now it's loading. So uh if I haven't explained this, Zeratul, by the way, that was a very long and and uh just very long. I was going to say long and lengthy, but that's would be repetitive, so I didn't. So, uh, if I haven't explained it, Zeratul is a Dark Templar who has kind of taken it upon himself to um, make sure that everything goes well and he's found this prophecy. And so now he wants to make sure that um it either it doesn't come true or when it does come true the Protoss will be prepared. 